when walking his dog very early in the morning, found the squid. He alerted us to it uh, and we came down immediately. Many people say that bigger is better, but what about when it comes to animals? And this is my friend Blossom, and her record is the tallest cow in the world. This is a giant freshwater stingray. Join us as we look at 10 abnormally large animals that are actually real. It does have a lot of hair because obviously it's such a big cat. He enjoys being groomed. 10. Great Dane Zeus. Guinness World Records has awarded a Great Dane the title of world's tallest living dog. Zeus, a two-year-old from Bedford, Texas, is the world's tallest dog, standing at three feet, five inches. He officially won the Possum Award on March 22nd, when his vet measured and certified his height. Owner Brittany Davis said she had always wanted a Great Dane named Zeus, and was overjoyed when her brother handed her the puppy when he was only eight weeks old. Although she was first concerned about his large stature, she quickly fell in love with him. Davis informed Guinness World Records that Zeus was a massive dog when she received him. Even as a youngster, he had huge paws. Zeus's Olympian diet consists of 12 cups of gentle giant's dog chow every day, along with the occasional fried egg and bully sticks. His absolute favorite treat is ice cubes. The brown and gray colossus is now a local celebrity, receiving attention and treats whenever he and his master visit the Dallas Farmer's Market. The most common comments Zeus's owner hears are, wow, that's a horse, or can I ride him? And does he have a saddle? The answer to all these queries is no. According to the American Kennel Club, Great Danes are descended from medieval hunting dogs. While they are noted for towering above other breeds, they are susceptible to a variety of health issues and have a shorter life expectancy than other dogs. Freddy, a Great Dane who formerly held the Guinness World Record for the tallest dog in the world, died last year at the age of eight. The dog, who resided in Essex, England, measured three feet and four inches from foot to withers. Standing on his hind legs, he towered over people at seven feet, five and a half inches. According to Guinness, the tallest dog ever recorded was Zeus, another Great Dane. He stood three feet and 10 inches tall. Nine, longest snake. Medusa weighs almost 300 pounds, is 25 feet long, and requires 15 people to hold her. She is about to set a record as the world's largest snake in captivity. The enormous python consumes a 40 pound animal roughly once a week, but could easily consume something weighing more than 100 pounds. Larry Elgar, Medusa's trainer, said he is not afraid of the giant python, even though they have been known to eat humans in the past. Fear is only a lack of comprehension according to him. Even though he is aware that she can murder him, he is fearless. He has already been wrapped up and rendered unconscious by a reticulated python that was just 18 feet long in the past. He understands the consequences, yet there is no reason to be afraid. He compares the gigantic snake to vehicles, which have killed more people than anything else in the world, but no one is afraid to put their keys in them. Mr. Edgar purchased the seven-year-old snake as a youngster, and she is still growing. Seven years ago, the snake was 24 inches long and as big as his finger. This man's fingers must be long. Medusa is poised to knock Fluffy, a reticulated python, from the top rank. Fluffy, at 24 feet long, held the record for the longest snake in captivity until her death in October at the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium in Powell, Ohio. Look out, people, because Medusa is on her way to stardom. In our thumbnail, we can see a giant squid that has washed up on shore. But to be honest, I'm not certain this is real. Why don't you let us know what you think in the comments below? 8. Ludo the Maine Coon Cat Ludo is the world's largest house cat, as well as the largest Maine Coon. He adores his family, particularly his human brothers, and always looks out for them. Ludo, a three-year-old Maine Coon from Wakefield, England, is an unusual cat. He was the largest kitten in his litter, according to Kelsey Gill. Before his first birthday, Ludo weighed 20 and a half pounds. Many people who met him when he was a kitten couldn't believe he was still so young. On October 6, 2015, Guinness World Records certified him as the world's longest domestic cat, measuring 3 feet and 10.59 inches. He now weighs 34 pounds and has gotten larger since last year, and it's possible that this gentle giant has grown longer in length. Ludo, the adorable fluffy kid, adores his tiny nine-pound baby brother Ryder. The family isn't surprised that Ludo has a large heart for his humans. When he was a kitten, he was extremely protective of his younger brother, Kelsey's son Cameron, and was always by his side. They became inseparable pals. Ludo is as thick as thieves and is usually by his side. He's extremely nice, a giant softy, like a big teddy bear with a laid-back disposition. When the little child was not feeling well, Ludo kept him company the entire time. He enjoys being close to both families 
Ashley's young boys, and it appears that he is keeping an eye on them. Cameron grew bigger, and so did Ludo. The family has two other cats in the house. One is Arwen, a 10-pound calico who enjoys snuggling with Ludo and giving him baths. The smaller cat is not particularly small. Their other cat, Crum, is 14 pounds and is also a Maine Coon, but he is less than half the size of Ludo. Ludo is the ruler, protector, and gentle giant of his domain. One and a half years later, Ludo's favorite thing in the world, aside from eating, is being among children. 7. Tallest Horse In 2010, Big Jake took the reign of the world's tallest horse from Remington, a Clydesdale horse. This huge horse stands at over 6 feet tall. Now that is tall. The only other horse that stood taller than Big Jake was Samson, who stood at over 7 feet tall. That is gigantic, if you ask me. Jerry Gilbert bought Big Jake when he was just 3 years old. When Big Jake was born, he weighed 240 pounds, which is 50 pounds more than the average Belgian horse. They are the ones who reached out to the Guinness Book of World Records when Big Jake was 8 years old because they couldn't believe how tall he was, and everyone was telling them that they should find out if he was actually the tallest horse in the world at that time. On top of being tall, Jake has a great personality. He just loves to hang out with people and play around, and he especially likes to play with people's hair. He has an amazing temperament, and he's just great to have around. He eats 40 quarts of oats per day and a bale and a half of hay and as much water. At night, this 2,600-pound horse settles in his 20 by 20 feet stall where he spends the night. Because of his height, he has become quite popular, and there are tours that offer people the chance to go out and see Big Jake in person. 6. Tallest Cow Blossom was not your typical domestic bovine. She was the same height as Jeff Goldblum. Unfortunately, Blossom, the world's tallest cow, died at the age of 13 after only holding the title for a year. Blossom's stature of 6 feet 4 inches seemed imposing, but she was a gentle giant with a loving bond with her owner, Pat Hansen, who referred to her as her best friend. Blossom was euthanized after suffering a leg injury and laid to rest in her favorite field on the farm where she grew. Blossom, who stood one foot taller than the typical Holstein cow, was declared the world's tallest cow by Guinness in the 2016 edition of the Guinness World Records book. Aside from holding the world record for bovine height, Blossom also served as ambassador to Memory Lane Crafting Retreat, a meeting place for women to spend time and share their love of quilting, knitting, scrapbooking, and other crafts. Blossom's role was to greet people as they came at the retreat, which was situated on her farm in Orangeville, Northern Illinois. The number of people who accepted and fell in love with her was incredible. She made so many people happy, and the world was a better place because of her. Despite being a world-renowned public personality and Guinness record holder, she remained the cherished greeter and ambassador at Memory Lane Crafting Retreat, as well as her owner's best friend. Putting Blossom down was one of the most difficult decisions Hansen has ever had to make. Blossom was not expected to stand again after slipping and falling and severely tearing a ligament in her back leg. Instead of allowing her to suffer, Hansen chose to relieve her agony and transport her to a better place. Blossom has clearly touched many people's lives, as countless fans paid tribute after hearing the sad news of her passing. 5. Biggest Stingray A stingray was caught in Thailand, breaking the Guinness record for the largest freshwater fish caught by rod and line. The massive flat fish with a fatal barb spanned more than 8 feet wide, 14 feet long, and weighed about 800 pounds. Jeff Corwin, an American television environment conservationist, caught it in Thailand's Maeklong River with the help of fishing guides from UK, based Fish Siam Limited. It took two hours to reel in the giant catch, with five guys on board a small fishing boat taking turns with the pole. After bringing the ray alongside, it was transferred to a specially designed corral, where seven people lifted the ray out of the water so it could be accurately measured. Because such fish are too large to weigh with scales, a tried and true procedure for calculating weight is to measure their width, length, and girth. The huge catch was featured on the ABC television show Ocean Mysteries with Jeff Corwin in the United States. According to top stingray specialists, this is certainly the largest freshwater fish ever captured with a rod and reel. The event was a true highlight of the series, as it involved not only engaging with a record-sized ray, but also participating in cutting-edge science, resulting in an amazing Ocean Mysteries episode. Humphreys stated that he and his crew have caught over 450 distinct stingrays, and their estimates have proven to be extremely accurate on the few instances when they have weighed this species. The larger specimens are always female and frequently pregnant, as was the case with this capture. This recent capture shows that these stingrays are growing at a rapid and healthy rate, which is great news. 4. Biggest Wildcat Hercules, an adult male liger, a lion-tigress hybrid, is the largest living cat. He is now held at Myrtle Beach Safari, a wildlife reserve in South Carolina, USA. He measures 131 inches in overall length, 49 inches at the shoulder, 
and weighs 922 pounds. Hercules consumes approximately 30 pounds of meat per day, equivalent to the weight of a two-year-old child, washed down with many liters of water. His brother, Sinbad, is significantly taller, but also lighter. Hercules has four nephews that were born in 2014, Yeti, Odin, Samson, and Apollo. These are the first white ligers ever born, with Yeti being the largest of the group. Ligers are often larger than their two parent species, tigers and lions. In contrast, Tigons, the offspring of a male tiger and a lioness, are frequently smaller than their parents. Although lions and tigresses cross spontaneously without the use of IVF, this only occurs in parks and reserves because lions and tigers do not cross territories in the wild. In general, male hybrids are sterile. 3. Japanese Spider Crab The Japanese spider crab is a type of marine crab and the largest in the waters surrounding Japan. It possesses the biggest known leg span of any arthropod at approximately 10 feet. This species is known as Taka Ashigani in Japanese, which translates to tall legs crab. To reach its large size, it goes through three major larval phases, as well as a presual stage. Its complex taxonomic past contributes significantly to who these creatures are and how they develop to become what they are today. They are sought after by crab fisheries and regarded as a delicacy in Japan. To avoid overexploitation from causing harm to the species, conservation initiatives have been implemented to safeguard these creatures and their populations from over fishing. A Japanese spider crab, nicknamed Crabzilla, has a basketball-sized body that stretches 10 feet across. It will eventually increase 3 feet to its enormous stature. The Colossus was taken by a fisherman in the Pacific and is currently on exhibit at Birmingham's National Sea Life Center. Japanese spider crabs are formidable predators in their natural habitat, despite being limp and lethargic out of the water because they cannot hold their massive limbs. The species, which lives up to 2,500 feet deep in the frigid Pacific, is orange in appearance and has murder claws. It is said that these crabs can grow to be 15 feet across. He dwarfs the other crabs in there, but he's not aggressive, so they shouldn't worry. He has already spent time in quarantine and will eventually be sent to Belgium. Crabzilla's front limbs are his feeding arms, which are more than five feet long and have claws. Spider crabs are a Japanese delicacy that is typically salted and boiled. However, eating them in the spring is prohibited because they lay egg. 2. Biggest Spider Spiders give humans the heebie-jeebies, and that includes me. There's something about having too many legs that makes folks uncomfortable. The fact that some are venomous just heightens our anxieties, and the bigger they are, the more negative we feel about them. There are about 4,000 spider species in the United States and Canada, which some may consider to be an excessive number. Tarantulas account for 50 of them, and they can be found in the country's central and southwestern regions. None of these 50 tarantula species are particularly notable for exceeding any size or weight limits, yet some people are unaware that tarantulas exist in the United States. The world's largest tarantula is known as the Goliath bird-eating spider or bird-eater. Physically, it lacks significant patterning and is quite unattractive in its pale to dark brown coloring. It is the largest spider by mass, weighing around two decks of cards. It is the second largest in terms of leg span, but 11 inches is nothing to scoff at. It would take up most of a standard-sized dinner plate. It is not one of our 50 native tarantula species, which may make you feel a little better about living in the United United States. This enormous species lives in South America's upland rainforests. Despite its frightening moniker, which conjures up visions of massive spiders snatching birds from the air, the Goliath bird-eating spider eats few birds. Its vast size and opportunistic feeding behavior lets it consume almost everything it can subdue. But birds are rarely on the menu. Its food includes rodents, lizards, frogs, insects, snakes, and the rare bird, but it primarily eats toads and earthworms. Although unusually enormous for a spider, its venom is harmless to humans and feels like a bee or wasp sting. The pain is likely caused by the one and a half inch long fangs that cut through the skin. The fangs are long and strong enough to puncture the skull of a mouse, so venomous or not, I would avoid touching it. When startled, the Goliath bird-eating spider rears on its back legs, displaying an astonishing set of gleaming black fangs. If that doesn't dissuade the potential predator, it rubs specialized hairs together to produce a hissing sound, like Velcro being ripped apart. If that fails, the spider will whirl around and kick barbed hairs into the harasser's eyes, nose, mouth, and skin. This cloud of urticating hairs causes severe discomfort and itching for several days and is said to be far worse than the venomous bite. Tarantulas frequently use this barbed hair strategy, but the Goliath bird-eating spider is reputed to have the most painful urticating hairs of them all. Locals catch and consume this spider, which has a shrimp-like 
like flavor. Tarantulas are first fried over a fire to remove the unpleasant hairs before being baked on banana leaves. The Goliath bird-eating spider, like most tarantulas, has a lengthy lifespan. Females live for about 15 to 25 years, while males die at roughly 3 to 6 years old. These behemoths are occasionally seen in the pet trade, and females can easily outlast dogs. I saw one at a pet store 15 years ago for 150 US dollars. Assuming it was sold to someone who was committed to its care, the specimen is likely still alive to 1. Biggest Rabbits Here is something you don't see every day. Darius the Continental Giant Bunny is 4 feet 4 inches long and weighs a whopping 50 pounds. The Guinness World Record holder from Worcester munches through 12 carrots, 6 apples, and 2 cabbages a day, and he snacks on hay throughout the day too. Darius is the fourth world record rabbit owned by model and grandmother Annette Edwards. He lays on a table at his home while Edwards showed him off. He could grow another 4 to 6 inches, according to Edwards. She says jokingly that it's quite scary just thinking about it. Darius thinks he's a dog, according to his owner. He eats at the table and lays across Edward's lap to be petted when she watches TV. Every day he wolfs down a bowl of rabbit chow, two apples, a dozen carrots with their leafy tops, and half a cabbage. Fortunately, since Edwards raises her own vegetables, feeding Darius isn't that expensive. To say that some of these animals were beasts would be an understatement. I once had a Great Dane who wasn't as tall as Zeus, but he was built like a brick wall compared to the lanky and thin Zeus. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thank you for watching and see you next time.